Well, thank you, Minister. Uh, thank you, Warwick and uh, Roger. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I really think that this is quite an historic moment for Christchurch City because what we are hearing today is that that 106,000 ideas from the people of my city that went into shape this inspirational plan are being taken seriously, that this is the volume that government are saying they are taking forward as the shape of this city. And so all of the work that's been put into this by our people, by the staff of our organization and the many people who joined us from around the world to create this is not in vain. It is what we are going to do. And what today really is about for us is about how do we take this brilliant vision, this, uh, this dream for our city and turn it into reality. And to have the commitment from central government to uh, work together in partnership to deliver this uh, is, I believe, all we could ask. This is exactly the right approach that we need to take at this time. The opportunity that's in front of us as a city, as everybody, I think, really understands, is absolutely enormous. To have the space, to have the opportunity, the scale of the devastation, which has come at a great price to our people and to our city, but as the basis of a chance to rebuild is something absolutely extraordinary. And I think what's really important to all of us is that what we get out of this as a city has to ensure that we have a great future, that it has to be that city that we hoped for in those darkest hours. And we need to be sure that it's a quality outcome. We don't want shortcuts. We don't want things happening here that will take away from us the opportunity to build this great place into the city it needs to be to give all of us a future. And one of the most encouraging things that I saw very early on in one of the early draft papers that the minister asked me to give some input to was a realization that what happens here in Christchurch doesn't just affect us as a city, but it's a vital part of the uh, economy of New Zealand. And I think that the importance that is now being brought to this project by combining with Sarah to deliver this plan, to make sure that what we get out of this is the best for our city that we possibly can, that we don't lose the opportunity by having inappropriate structures or developments or losing the impetus of imagination that drove us to this place is very important. So I'm very supportive of what is proposed here. I believe it is in the best interests of our city and I think we've taken a major step toward uh, a great outcome for the people of Christchurch and for the future of this province and our country. So thank you.